Samsung TV Plus, right? Like nobody wants that. Well, maybe some of you do, but I don't. So how do you get rid of it? Because when you go and hold on to the button, it doesn't do anything. But instinctively unnatural, you have to press down. You press down and then you say remove. And then it says, select this blah, blah, blah. And you go remove. But you can also disable, right? But I'm just gonna remove it. And now it's gone. I don't need that stupid thing there anymore. I can do this for all of the stuff that I want. But I like these ones, so I'm gonna keep them now. But now I have my TV back. Ah, sadly, you still can't get rid of this. Down, up, nothing. You can't press anything, unfortunately. There's only one thing you can do, which makes it a little bit different. Terms and privacies and then you go to privacy choices. And then privacy choices, when you click it, it takes a while, right? And you select terms and conditions, privacy policies. And then this loads up and then you can press up and down and then you can select the stuff that you want. So for example, you can check this box. You say, oh, I want viewing information services. You want them to know and you want interest-based advertisements so that like you don't see stuff that you don't want. But otherwise, even if you uncheck it, you're still gonna see the same thing. You're just gonna see like some random ads here. This is inevitable, as Thanos says. Wow, you've made it to the end screen. Not a lot of people make it here. Click on the subscribe button or the like button or the bell button or any of these videos. They're all buttons for you to press. It's really fun, trust me, press them, press them, press them, press, press all of them.